Hello YouTube, um, this is Samsung Galaxy Tab 3 T210 running uh, KitKat. It's a very light ROM based on stock ROM 4.4.2. So, this is Wi Fi version 8GB. And if you wish really to install this ROM, I'm going to show you how. So, first of all, you need to install custom recovery. So, I'm, I'm choosing uh, Croc World mod recovery and I upload all the files needed on for shared and down in the description I'm going to give you links to those um, to those um, files. So first of all you need to boot your tablet into um, into download mode. So to do that so you need to press down the the home button and then volume down and then the power button so for a second all together and that's we call this download mode so after this it tells you volume up to continue so I'm going to press now volume up this, this one here so I am in download, uh, downloading mode so from here on your computer um, I have this file here, uh, Odin. I have the link again in the description. So you're going to unzip that one using the unzip thing, and from there you open Odin and and run it as run it as um, administrators like this and then ok so from here now I'm going to plug in my tablets so I plug in and you see the message there it says added on Odin um, if it didn't say added in your case that means you need to install drivers so instead of giving you drivers I'm going to show you how to lit your Windows um, computer to load uh, to load the drivers automatically. So, computer, right click, and then properties. From there, advanced setting, advanced setting, and then hardware, and then device installation setting. So in your case you're going to find no let me choose what to do. So just click this one here and then save changes and then OK. So in this case now your computer will install drivers automatically. So mine already installed, so there's nothing going on there. And Odin as well. Um Odin as well uh, recognized my tablet and it says added. So from here now uncheck the, this auto reboot. Everything is unchecked, nothing is checked except this one here. If reset time, so and then PDA from there, choose this file here Clockword mod T10, uh, uh, and then I choose it. So, where it is, it's in desktop. So, I'm looking for it, it's this one here, and then you open and then just hit start. Mine is already done, so once you hit start, be patient and let it till you see a pass in this box. Once you see pass in this box, then exit and then unplug your tablet. And then unplug the tablet like this, and then hold down and then hold down the the power button. Like so, all down for a few seconds, maybe. That's it. So, once the tablet is powered off, you need to check that you have the custom recovery installed in your tablet. So, I'm going to boot in, into this custom recovery. So, home button, I'm clicking there, and then volume 
up this time not volume down volume up and then at the same time the power button once you see the logo lift your finger off the power and I'm still holding that's it so I have there custom recovery CWM based recovery version 6.0.4.9 so from here you need just to reboot your system after that once you reboot your system place those files to update super user and this one here the 20 stock I have all links a description to download them and then if you want to fix your root axis you have to place as well this file in your tablet so those two files basically this one here which is a ROM it's a stock ROM based 4.4.2 and then update super user once you place them then go back and reboot your system into recovery like so and from there you need to wipe data factory reset you do it you click power and you do it wipe cache uh, partition and then um, mount and storage you go in there and then format system once you format the system go back and then go to advanced and uh, wipe Dalvik cache. I always do this and I have no problems with the ROMs whatsoever. Wipe Dalvik cache and then go back and then the robot your system, right? So power and then robot your system. It, it tells me there to fix the root thing, but I don't need to because I, I have root access. I did root this tablet, so I have root access. So once you've done that, you have to log again into recovery and install this file here from zip update super user. So you're going to install that file from the recovery. Once you've done that, so fingers crossed, you're going to have root access and very light ROM based on stock ROM 4.4. And you'll see the well this I changed uh, the I changed the wallpaper so you'll see the ROM is working perfect so if I go to sit in here to show you and about device you're going to see there device name T210 and in Android version 4.4.2 and that's the KitKat logo as usual as the Android so the bar of chocolate the KitKat. Um, it's very smooth as you say and it's just like stock ROM but it's KitKat which is and all what I like about it is uh, there is no stuff uh, but uh, bloatware from Samsung like the other one so all the stuff is um, removed and as you noticed here, I'm using this web browser, you see, it's the best one i ever seen, you know, you see browser. And at the same time as well, what I did, I uh, in install the Chrome web browser um, using, well, because I have root access, so that's the browser there, and using in installer pro, so to in install the system to, inst to install the system um, applications so you can in install all any application that you might not need so so far so good everything is working the Wi-Fi the GPS everything 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 anyway thanks YouTube for watching um, as I told you links are down a description so you can download all the required files to do this um, project and thank you very much for watching, please comment as, as usual, comment, like and subscribe. Thank you very much.